So this video is on preparation of Word report using a Microsoft Word document. If you want to prepare a thesis or a project report, we can use the Microsoft Word template which makes the things easier and reduces much time in editing. So here I will show those features which can be used in thesis or report writing. And this makes uh, report preparation easier. So here I'm going to explain about these following features, style, table of contents, list of figures, list of tables, references, commands, which gives these details and how to use those commands. A template is provided for this purpose. A link is provided in the description box. You can download and make necessary changes and you can use it to generate your report. So first feature is style. So here it assigns font style, size, spacing, etc. So this, is, this we can assign to headings, body of text, etc. Second feature is table of content. So it automatically inserts headings, page numbers, and take care about alignment and also update the details with just a click of a button. Third feature is a list of figures. So this command will insert headings, page numbers, and take care about alignment and also update the details with the just a click of a button. Similarly, list of tables. So it will insert the tables in the document along with the page number. And the last one is uh, references. It automatically lists all the references made in the document in the assigned on order. And it is it can be with the required format. So this is the template. So this is the cover page, the title of the project, name of the university, the degree and name of the candidate, name of the guide. This is as per the, your organization, you can change this style. And abstract should come here acknowledgement section here content page space for list of figures and list of tables and then chapters with some headings here i have just shown some examples this is not required you can delete this so similarly chapter 2 and at the end reference section so right side is the template left side is the document which is with the content what you need to do is just copy this and paste in respective sections so this is the style toolbar this gives a list of the styles So I'm copying this abstract, copying in abstract section. I just paste it there. So just select the text and assign the style. It is body text, it is assigned. You can observe the change. Similarly, in acknowledgement section, I will copy the acknowledgement. Paste 
in acknowledgement section just select that content and assign the style content page should come here list of figures and list of tables chapter so this is not required i will just remove this part so just copy the chapter and paste in the template so heading Select the heading and assign the style heading 1 and then subheading select and make it style heading 2. Just select and assign the style. You can observe the change in font style spacing i will just assign the number for this So this text should be the body text style select and make it body text Just follow the same procedure for chapter 2. So chapter 2 contains some figures and tables. I just included some sample figures so that I can show you how to use the uh, features like list of figures and list of tables. So here I just pasted the content. Select the text and it is heading 1. This is subheading. I will make it heading 2. Body text again. This is the name of the figure. Just select the text and assign style figure. I will assign number for this.
first of all uh, just because the name is missing so i will just copy this I will just give a new name for this. This has to be set to the style figure. And one table is there here. So I will give a number for this. I will select this and assign to style table. So like this, follow the same procedure for all chapters. And then at the end is references. So here we should insert all the references you made in the document. So for that, you can use this option. Go to references. So here manage sources. So here you can have list of all references. If you want to insert, you can just click on new. And Give, give these details. It can be a book or gen, journal or a conference proceeding. Select and give all the details. You need not to worry about the format. It takes care about the format. So whichever you want to insert in the particular document, you can just select and say copy. It will be inserted. can also sort by author or by title or year. It will be sorted in right here. It's a references. Here I want to insert the references. So select the style. So here I'm selecting APS style and insert bibliography. It will insert all references that you have selected with the style APA. So this is a very good uh, feature in this. It saves a lot of time. You need not to worry about the format. You can also insert in the order of you referred. So this is table of contents. So go to references table of contents and you will get table of contents here you can see here all the headings what you selected it will be inserted with respective page numbers so it saves a lot of time if you want to make any changes afterwards we can just uh, right click on table and update it will be updated so, so here i will move this content chapter to heading to page number three you can see it is in page number three now but in content page it is still in page number two so to update this just right click and say update it will be updated you can see it is now it is in page number three so like this at the end you can just update the table it will be updated along the respective page number now to insert list of figures just go to that position so here i will make this as heading one 
so list of table heading one so below this list of figures should come so go to that position so there are two figures here figure 2.1 and figure 2.2 figure 2.1 in page number 3 before that make sure that it is assigned all the figures are assigned to respective style so this here it should be style figure similarly this figure figure 2.2 so it is assigned to figure the table also should be assigned to the respective style make sure that you make all figure name to respective style and then go to that position where you need to insert list of figures go to references insert table of figures option here select the style the style is figure say ok so you can see the figures are listed with respective page number same procedure for list of tables Go to references, insert table of figures, go to option, here style, select style table. So you can see the table, so in this document there is only one table page number 4 so it is inserted so like this you can use these features it saves lot of time you need not to worry about the editing so it takes case of fonts spacing alignment so many things if you want to make any changes in the style you can make it